Yo, what's up, Tarnish? It's your boy, Albie, and we're back with another video. In today's video, we're going to be talking about um, the, the Mangekyo and Sharingan um, tier list, and we're going to basically be putting it where we want to be putting this um, tier list, and we're going to do it based off of skills and just like how useful it's going to be in combat and and all that, all right? So, I know a lot of people are aiming for Madara's. It is broken. Uh, Madara V1. But I think every um, spec has, you know, has this unique trait to it. So let's go down and see what it what it do for real. Um, so first, first and foremost, though, make sure I leave a like, comment and subscribe and, you know, join the family. We're on the road to 7K subscribers. Let's make sure that happens. We post every single day over here. We don't miss a day. And sometimes we triple quadruple upload, you know, on a busy day. But. Without further ado, let's get straight into the mama video. You know what I'm saying? So first and foremost, we're gonna start with Azuna's Azuna's eye. Azuna's eye is um so what it basically does, it makes you take zero damage. It makes you take zero damage for five seconds. So Azuna eyes is not that bad for a common. A lot of people don't want it. A lot of people don't want it, but you know, five seconds is not it's not that bad. Honestly, I'll put it at B tier. I'll put it at B tier. There's there's some that are worse. Um Indra's Indra's eye. Indra's eye does what it does, fifty percent more damage. Stabs. Alright, so basically you st you stun and then you know people they stab themselves and then they do it does fifty percent of their health. That sounds a little broken too. Not gonna lie, I probably put this right in front of this one. Cause that damage the damage is insane honestly because even though you go invisible you can still get smoke um you feel me you can still get smoke you know, i'll put it at c tier actually if y'all disagree with me you know that can go you know kick some rocks um the next one is um sasuke's eyes so sasuke eyes susano sure reflective uh, okay so it's basically it's basically the same thing as this one, but you know it's a suit so no, so I just put it in front of it. Um I don't know how long it stays, it doesn't say the cooldown, but it's Sasuke V2, it's not a V1. And then for Itachi V2, Itachi V2 gives you a, a red Susano with you know the uh basically you can't get burned, stunned, and poison. I honestly think it's garbage. It probably has to be the worst Sharing Gun you could possibly get. Only because bro, status effect really. So it's a whole spec, bro. It's a whole spec. Like, it, could, it could it could do better. It could do better. Um, then we got Obito's Mangekyo and Sharingan. So what it does is it makes you untouchable for um, three seconds. It's okay. I think honestly, I think it's. I think it's like right behind this one. Three seconds is not. It's nothing crazy. It's nothing crazy. But it's, it's it's decent. It's decent, untouchable. And then we got Itachi. So this is a legendary. Itachi's um, V1. Itachi V1. You get um, black. You get basically a Mataratsu. Mataratsu is actually pretty broken. So they're gonna go ahead and put it in the A tier. I think that's a really good spec. I think all the legendaries are pretty good. And then we got Obito's. Obito's give you a under forty percent. Are you 40% under blah, 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 blah. I can't even speak. under 40% health is automatically an execution. So honestly, I think this is like a S tier. Because bro, all you gotta do is be near somebody and just activate your spec and they're dead. <laughs> as long as they're under 40, and that's insane, bro. That's insane. So we got Madara V2. Madara V2. We have both moderates. So Madara V2 create a blue so it's gonna give you two times you two times damage for five seconds. So you can get double the damage with this suits and ability. Honestly, I think it's okay. I think it sits, it sits, it sits behind Itachi's. Um, um, bro, it's only five seconds, bro. It's not crazy. I mean, you could probably like pop that again in like a few minutes, but I don't know. I don't know. Y'all can, y'all can honestly switch it around if y'all feel like it, it deserves a higher rating. <coughs> but for me personally, I think that's good. Um, and then we got last but not least, we got the one that I'm currently using, which is um, Madara's Amangeku and Sharingan B1. So this is currently the best Sharingan within the game, the best Sharingan you can possibly get. 
but also again i think itachi is up there and no i didn't do that because a lot of people were saying that itachi could fight madara that's how good he was but i'm saying that it's really good so now listen to the perks of its v um its v effect so you get a hundred percent critical you get a hundred percent dodge chance and major speed boost and have cooldowns on all your abilities so honestly out of all these eyes madara's v1 has to be like damn near the strongest one that you could possibly get it has a lot of buffs bro it's really broken i ain't cap to you it's a lot of it gives a lot it gives a lot i'm not gonna lie and it has a super low cooldown <clears throat> like it, it literally gives you a cooldown increased cooldown just for having it but yeah make sure i leave a like comment subscribe and let me know how i feel about this tier list the only reason why i'm talking so low is because i'm a little tired and i know i have to push a video out today for y'all so i just went out my way and made this video real quick and i'm about to go to sleep because i gotta work tomorrow um make sure i leave a like comment subscribe all the links to this game will be down below um i'll catch y'all on the next video and like i like to say brush your head take care and i'll see you in the next one Eagles, uh.